Hi, I'm here to make a video. <laughs> um, I'm gonna do like Valentine's Day look. This is one by, um, what's her name? Bethany Moda. And um, this was, this is an older video. I'll link it in the description, but it's really cute. It was really done well. Um, this was back when she would make like makeup tutorials and hair tutorials and stuff like that. Um, so I wanted to make a January favorites video, but I wanted to wear makeup, you know, so I'm just getting ready for that. Um, and doing like a cute Valentine's Day makeup look. So yeah, I'm going to start off with the Mari Badescu facial spray with aloe, cucumber, and green tea. And then the CeraVe Moisturizing Cream. My skin gets really dry in the winter. And the foundation doesn't go on good if I don't have like moisturizing cream on. You see how it gets red? It's so sensitive. And I was using the CoverGirl Outlast Extreme Wear, but it wasn't going good on my skin. Um, it was like peeling in the nose area and it, it was just going on like look like I had alligator skin so um I'm gonna go back to my Revlon color stay it's like all worn off but it's color stay for normal slash dry skin and I go back and forth like what kind of foundation I get sometimes I use the one for combination skin like in the I think in the um, summertime I would use that one but my skin is combination so right now um, it just it needs one for dry skin I think so I don't know if I should use my brush because it's not washed and it has the old foundation on it so I think I'll just use my fingers I think I need to start watching like newer tutorials because I'm sort of watching older videos. <laughs> I like the ones from the 2010s. I think I need to like update my makeup routine maybe. I just like, I just, um, I like the personalities of the people in the YouTube world, um, back then, like, like about, um, I'd say 10 years ago, they were really, they were really cheerful and bubbly and it made me feel like it kind of, like, made me feel happy to do my makeup or something, I don't know. Um, so anyway, um, that's my foundation done. And next I'm gonna put on powder. So I'm gonna use this Maybelline Fit Me and Translucent.
I didn't put a primer on, but I'm not going anywhere. So I don't need it to last a long time, my makeup. I'm just getting ready to make a video. I actually put on eye primer. Um, I always use this one by, by Milani, the eyeshadow primer. So I'm going to use this. And if you like the makeup that I'm wearing, that I'm going to show how to do, um, you don't have to have the same makeup as me. Just like I don't have the same makeup as Bethany Moda in this video I'm copying. She used an old e.l.f. makeup palette that's not around anymore. It's called The Little Black Beauty Book. The Cool Python Edition. Um... So, um, she used a, it's like a peachy champagne color on the eyelid, so I think I'm going to use, hmm, I might use one of these, I don't know if this is still available, it's the Makeup by Denise, by Pix Pixie Plus Makeup by Denise, it looks like this, um, I think I'm going to use this color. Just a pretty peachy color and put it on my eyelid. kind of blend it in the top part like above my eyelid and then she used a matte brown um, in the crease and outer corner so you you don't use to have to have a brown eyeshadow you can use like a bronzer um, I think what I'm gonna do just use a bronzer. I have the Benefit Hula bronzer. It has cute packaging. This is, I don't know if their packaging still looks like this. It's probably older now. Um, this might have a little bit of gray on it. put it like in the outer part of my eye and then in the middle area the crease so this eye look is really easy to do um except for the eyeliner it's tricky for me And then she took a pink blush and she used it for eyeshadow. So, let's see. I'm going to use this one by CoverGirl. It's called Classic Pink. Just take the same brush. 
put it in the inner part of my crease. Now comes the hard part, is putting the eyeliner on. It's hard for me. I don't know about you. It's the, This is the Maybelline Master Precise All Day Liquid Liner. Looks like that. And I don't know if this makes my eyes water, but sometimes my eyes water. Just need to be careful not to put it in my eye, <laughs> obviously. I'm just kind of winging it out. it a bit thick on the side. I still need to fix my hair. <laughs> but that's I'm it this eye is easier for me to do, but this eye is like trickier. Kind of skips. I'm trying to even it out. It's more of a wing. Like a lot more. To put mascara on. So I like to use the L'Oreal Lash Paradise. It's my favorite. Got the text message. I don't know how to not get it on my computer. Next, um she put like a highlighter on. So I'm going to 
see. I like the L'Oreal Lumi Glow Nude highlighters. This one is in Moon Kissed. And I think I'm going to take this one. Next she took Milani Baked Blush in Dolce Pink and that's when I actually have the same as her. Looks like this. really pretty like pink with a gold looks golden in the light it looks cute like kind of dolly like the eyes look kind of dolly um and then for lipstick she used like this or l'oreal lipstick that i don't um i don't have and i don't know if it's available anymore but um i'm just gonna use this pink um this is maybelline superstay ink crayon in the color treat yourself so I'm going to use this. This is like a matte finish, but I'm going to put gloss over it. It's a very bright pink, like a hot, a hot pink. It's a little bit darker shade than my, my hoodie. But if you want like an alternative for red for Valentine's Day, this is a pretty shade. Um, and then I like putting the Lip Gloss Buxom Katie by, I think it's Buxom is the brand. It used to be Bare Minerals, but they changed or they made like, I don't know if it's a different company or now. But you can just get whatever gloss you have. So that's my finished look. <laughs> I hope you like it. And I hope you guys are doing okay. I'll talk to you later. Bye.